all right boys it's been eight days since i started this daily upload stuff so you know the drill so let's do it yeah but this <laughs> this summer chose man they just always isolated from the group and it's just dancing around and going hoo ha hoo ha ya hoo ha ya hey. that was an easy one that's one Elon Musk yet again this girl I don't know if they intentionally named her that name Elon Musk as in reference to Elon Musk but I don't think it garnered that much attention not that people I don't think many players pointed out this yeah I think that most of people just don't care about it and it's a bad reference Elon Musk like for real though yeah and I think there there was a con controversy I don't know if, if you can call it a controversy but there was an issue been uploaded there, there are many videos uploaded on youtube saying that oh genshin trying to make elon musk play the game because they they mentioned him by naming one of the npc elon musk i mean why and people find that cringe i don't know i'm just saying all right okay i've been playing this commission dozens of times so i know what what should do look look see it's easy it's easy money it's easy good thing that the first two commissions so far is easy piece of cake mate doesn't take much long all right that's two 20 primo gems you guys call crisis oh this commission another easy commission shouldn't take that long i should have just one shot them with raiden shogun so many people people would wonder am i going to get bored playing the same character all over again for more than a year i say no i say no because Rider Shogun is pretty, for me is pretty fun. I don't care how long I'm going to play her, but as long as she can do what I want her to do, like one-shotting the enemies like she always does, then there's no problem. But before, when I play Ning Wang, that's on the other case. At first I was like, okay, she's fine. But after several months, I was just, I was like, okay, she's getting bored. But I have to steal myself i have to dedicate myself because i've been doing myself a challenge trying to save myself a lot of primo gems and after that maybe just maybe i can have fun with different character the, the ones that i'm going to see six after i get rather shogun things just changed her whole characterisms her designs her gameplay it suits me and it's fun playing her and i don't mind playing her for more than a year so yeah there's that another defeat all our opponents wow today's commissions is a breeze a walk in the park it's not that difficult it's not that time consuming at all good thing there's no danger call there's no escort missions if it's not i'm i'm gonna be so annoyed because that commission man it's just I know it's supposed to, I know it's easy but I just hate how much time consuming that commission is. Like the one that the one that you need to escort the balloon, you don't you don't need to defend it. You don't need to defeat the enemies just to defend that balloon. You just have to let it and it's not going to destroy the fight in mob. Just start the mission and just let it roll around and to the finish line. And then boom, you don't have to do anything. It won't get destroyed no matter hard no matter hard you tried. Because I've played it many times before and I tried it many times and it doesn't get destroyed by the mobs. You don't need to run around and destroy and kill all of the opponents. You don't need to because regardless the balloon still survives. And you're still able to finish the commission. But like I said, the thing that makes it so annoying is how much time you have to consume. And it wasn't really that necessary for Mihoyo to do that. At least they should amp up the difficulty of that commission. Then at least it means something after that. Alright, just finished all of the commissions. So, this is the last day. The last content from events that we can get. So, yeah, the fortuitous of for, for, for What the hell am I going to pronounce this? Fortuitous trial all right <laughs> so yeah this is the final final content of this event well a week a week worth of content but in order to get all of these primo gems all three of these which is total around 100 180 
in order to get 100 identity from this reward is you have to play i have to play this for three times so i'm not going to record that because as you guys know i'm running out of storage so i'm just going to skip forward all right just finished the event and i collected no i have not collected yet i just finished i just finished all of the events and just one event by the way but yeah so i just finished the events and i've completed three times so i should claim all of the primo gems so 180 i can claim this i've claimed this for 180 primo gems and plus with the commissions i've got 240 primo gems for today which is a lot of primo gems and the sad thing is the event is ending you can we can we can still play the event but we cannot get any more rewards from it and we have to wait for the next event to come in in order to get some of those some of that extra primo gems so all in all my primo gems count for today is 56,790 primo gems and still <laughs> the intertwined face just still stay the same which is 60 and i have i haven't done the standard banner pulls yet and yes I, I do have seven of them i just going to pull whenever i have enough 10 like 10 pull if i have enough to do some 10 pull on the standard banner now i pull for it but if it's not i'm just going to let it stay right there the primo count it still keep going steady and i'm going to keep this momentum which i like it and so yeah there's nothing special happened today and there's nothing more to it it's just some ordinary good old end gameplay routine collecting his primo gems daily so i hope you guys uh, have fun playing this game and play the, this event as long as you want it because you might not be able Able to play it again after this because it's temporary maybe it'll get a rerun in the future but still it's going to take a lot of time to wait for it to come again so have fun play the event as much as you like because this is the type of, of content that i find very fun and interesting and considering that Genshin impacts as of now if you completed all of the story quests if you explored all of the areas then this event is the only repeating content that you can spend your time on so have fun and i see you guys on the next day and god bless you all and bye bye